It was during Monday's Lisbon Selectman's meeting when all three members of the board resigned from their positions. Now, former chairman Tom Demers speaking to News 9 over the phone saying the decision was made after frustration grew over what he described as an uphill battle with some town residents when it came to making decisions on town policies. The departures coming just a day before Lisbon prepared to host its annual town voting day. We've had some interesting predicaments with our select board. Town moderator Robert Cook says the resignations had the town contacting state officials for a plan of action. We managed to do that. We met the legal requirements for the voting and we're voting today, which is good. So we're feeling good about that. State law requires a majority of a select board to be present at polling centers during elections. Officials at the State House approving Lisbon to swear in three new temporary members for the day to allow voting day to continue. Each member previously held a seat on the board. As long as they have the appropriate number of election officers, a moderator, a clerk, supervisors of the checklist, uh, they should be able to conduct the election. However, planning tonight's town meeting was not as easy. Cook says questions still remain as to if it can go on without the three original select men present. We haven't quite figured out if we've met the requirements to have a legal town meeting and uh, some other considerations that we have to look at. And now I did just have a chance to speak with the town moderator. He tells me that tonight's town meeting will take place. He says it will happen at 7 o'clock here at the Lisbon Regional School. That's the very latest live here in Lisbon. I'm Tim Callery, WMUR News 9.